Good morning. morning. Rock here. Nancy here. Return to the Mac. Oh my goodness, you're like a you like to take a deep breath before you say good morning. I like to give it my all. Oh yeah, I can see yeah. that. That's awesome. My all. How's everybody doing this morning? We are celebrating How with 2000 is hits. Everybody doing. The Come year on. 2000 seems like it's much simpler times back then, right? <sighs> Think about it. It's 20 years ago. I know. I remember I like when like, oh my god, the year 2K is going to be like... Y2K. Yeah, the Y2K is going to yeah. be the end of the world. Yeah. All and that stuff. And it's this 2021 seems like... Something else. There's always something, something else that's else. threatening the end of the world. I know, I know. It's, it's an experience like no other. Yeah. And even like, we were worrying about like, oh, what is this going to do to the kids and everything. But we went through like our fair share of like, nothing else, you know, and we... we we built resilience and, and, and strength and yeah. Well, we you know, were like we abused sexually. No, you no, were I'm talking about yeah, as so a we, collective. We've had, we've had our fair share of hardship. Yeah. No, I'm fair talking enough. about the collective, like the strike that we that that happened at our schools and oh, um, the simple stuff. Yeah. <laughs> compared to now, I guess it, just, it does yeah. seem simple. I'm but sorry. I mean, I'm sorry, but for me, like uh, having gone through hardship, anybody else there go through severe hardship? And you look at stuff like the pandemic, you're like, who cares? Well, I mean, that's, I guess, one way of putting it. I mean, if like, you're going through a whole lot, then I guess you can get, you can for endure me, more. Your pain tolerance is increased. Yeah, it's like I don't have that fear of, oh, my God, this is the worst thing ever. I'm like, wow. you know, no, I'll tell you what a worst time ever. Mm -hmm. I won't do it. Anyways, okay. time. <laughs> How's everybody doing? Cheers. Cheers. Jeez, we're starting out like a direct hit. <laughs> it's very, it's very thick. Mm. I forgot to put the ice in there, so it's not chilled. Ice, ice, maybe? Right. <laughs> ice, ice, no. Uh, yeah, so it's not like, yeah, it's a bit thick. No, my mm. point that it was, you know, if, you, if you've gone through severe hardship, a divorce, somebody died in your family, mm. uh, you've experienced abuse, it just seems like after, when stuff happens after, it's like, well, well, you've it increased your pain tolerance, your pain body tolerance. It but then, of is. course, at the same time, that pain body uh, reacts in other ways, like in either anger or anxiety. I feel like I'm a bit like uh, Al Bundy from Married with Children. What do you mean? In a way where it's like, I would come home and you would say something like, oh, I ran over the dog or something. And I'd be like, what's for dinner? <laughs> what's for dinner? <laughs> I, I knew it was gonna happen. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, I, I, hey, I mean, if you can, end, but there's a, there's, I find there is still um, like a negative side effects to those things. I mean, you think that you're resilient and your pain tolerance is, you're tolerant yeah. to a, a whole lot of stuff, but it does show up in other ways. And that's of something course. that's to keep of in course. mind. You gotta keep that in mind. Of yeah, yeah. I, I'm just joshing with you guys. I know. Come I know. on. I know. No, I, 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 I hear what you're saying because in that moment you're like, ah, it's not a big deal. But then uh, after a while you're like, you, you start yeah. to feel anxious for the littlest things and it's like or you feel like super irritated or yeah. no patience or angry yeah. for the littlest things and it's like yeah yeah so anyway. but that usually has nothing to do with the littlest things it's usually attached to the, the trauma, body, the trauma well, you experienced way back when that's exactly right. right yeah exactly yeah so today, today or this week this we are week, talking about minimalism minimalism, minimalism. So Friday, just a recap on Let's say that five times real minimal, quick yeah I know minimalism 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 <laughs> okay. you're doing good yeah uh, should be a rapper. Yeah. So Monday we should um, we talked about how to minimize, organize, downsize your space All that sort of because stuff. you know yep. like a cluttered mind equals no sorry a, a cluttered, cluttered environment equals, equals to a cluttered, a cluttered mind. mind. Yeah. And it's really true because everything has energy. So if it's all like a lot of stuff. Yep. The, the energy can't like flow easily, it becomes right. stagnant, and then yep. stagnant energy becomes unhealthy energy. Yeah. And then yesterday we were talking about how maybe like if you can find some way to downsize in like the bills, Items. financial yes, bills, services, yes. anything like that, that you can kind of like... Simplify. Simplify in, yeah. in a way, like if you have like cable, internet, mm -hmm. uh, your phone, and mm -hmm. different like different companies, maybe putting under all in one company just to simplify the bills. Yep. Um, yeah. Yeah. You know, do you need a, two cars or not? Maybe yeah, if you, you really maybe don't maybe need you don't. two cars, you know, then maybe Take a look at that, you know? Like it's just things that you don't have to like be anchored down yeah, you don't say have something to. would happen in the real world like a pandemic. It's like we, we have this idea that after, you know, this, there's like a blueprint 
for our lives. That's already set out in, ahead of us before Social we're even division. born. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You're going to get good grades. You're going to get a good job. You're going to pay your bills. You're going to buy the house. You're going to have a family. You're going to have cars and toys. That seems to be the blueprint for everybody, right? But it doesn't mean you have to do that. Mm -hmm. You don't have to follow that. You can think outside blueprint. the box. Yeah, you can do whatever the hell you want. You well, don't have to follow that, that blueprint, right? That's what I'm liking about the, the, like on Netflix, they're starting to, I feel like there's more like a, an awakening in that area where it's like, that was like the old mentality of thinking. Like it's just, I feel like now it's, there's more this of a, whole there's American a shift dream happening. Idea. Yeah, there's a shift happening. Like less is best, guys. It's like if you can yeah. downsize into simple living, if you will. I mean, yeah. this has really taught me that. Like it's like anything can happen. And we like, it, I want to have some wiggle room. Like I want some some flexibility. Yeah, some flexibility yep. to like. Uh, so like if something happens, then it's like, well, I can manage a few months or whatever because I'm not like living paycheck to paycheck, you know? Yeah. So today yeah. we're thinking about, well, not thinking about, but we're, we want to talk about how to minimize your negative thinking. Minimize your negative thoughts. Yeah. I mean, that is probably the mother of all yeah. <laughs> minimalism, if you will. Yes. But uh, it's uh, very easy for yes. us to, you know, especially nowadays thinking about everything that's going on, especially yeah. today with the politics and the... <laughs> In the United yeah, you States. want to simplify what's inside here, yeah. right? Yeah. Because uh, again, we've been uh, kind of conditioned into feeling like we got to be go, 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 and doing and <clears throat> doing and doing and doing. Yeah. And you know, I'll say what you've said many times: we're not human doings, uh, we're human beings. Yeah. Yeah. No, <laughs> so that true. means you can just dial that in. You don't have to do all that stuff. You can relax. Right. You can, uh, instead of trying to do 16 things at the same time, multitasking has been proven that the more tasks you try to take on, the less efficient you become in all tasks. Yeah. So you're trying to make six meals at once. Yeah. You're going to be bland. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> and it's true. And it's conditioning your brain to open up more tabs. So that way it creates more anxiety and yeah. more stress. So you really want to so. minimize that and simplify your thoughts. Yeah. As much and as you can. As much as you can. You, so you know, you've got 13 things on a list uh, or in your head that you've got to do. One of the simple things to do to take them out of your head and clear some space is to make a list. Yeah. You know, take it out it of down. your head and put take it, it out on of your paper. Head, put it yeah. on paper. Yeah. Right? And carry the list with you. And when you're done, check it off. All that. Know? And then you get a dopamine hit. Oh, it dopamine. Feels good. <laughs> dopamine hit. And no, it's true. I mean, there's ways to, to simplify th yeah. thinking, multitasking thinking, if, mm -hmm. that, if that's a thing. It is a thing. And then uh, negative thinking. And oftentimes, I find myself just wanting to do many things and keep busy because I don't, I wanna, I don't wanna be alone with my thoughts. But if I can train yeah. my mind, into thinking more peacefully and positively and yeah. less, you know, negatively. And like, you yeah. know, I always go to that emotion of, you know, worry and fear and anxiety. And lack. And eh, not so much. Scarcity. Lack. No, actually I'm, I'm quite content and fulfilled, but yeah. just more like the worry. I, that's my go-to emotion is the worry. So I have to learn how it's okay to not having to always having to do something. Cause I know like, if I'm about to, like, I'll, I'll plan out my day and then at the end of the day there's yep. room, I'm like, oh, well, what can I fit in there? So yeah. I don't have to be alone with my thoughts. Exactly. But it's like, then I need to learn to, like, to be alone with the thoughts mm -hmm. and just, to be okay relax. with my thinking yeah. and, and train my mind to you be more. You don't have to do anything. No, I know. I this know. one. I know. I've got to do something. I know. I know. <laughs> like, and I got to grab her and I got to hold on yeah. to her. Like, no, just relax. I know. I know. Pretty. Thank you. Just want to put that out there. <laughs> Isn't she pretty? So a challenge today is just being more mindful of thinking. Yeah, um, be more mindful of that. Being more mindful of how you're thinking and like what are you trying to escape from. If you're like if your monkey mind is going, then try to bring it down yeah. to more of a monk state of mind. Yeah, you know just what I mean. Relax. So, yeah. Focus on breathing today as well. Just. We Take talked about this breath. yesterday. Air is free. You can have as much as you want. You know, yeah. it's not in short supply. Right. You know? I mean, I think Brendan was talking about like when you're oftentimes when you're at the uh, the set like the set of lights and it's red and it's like instead of like reaching for your phone, uh, which you just, shouldn't be doing. No, I know, but everybody does it. Come on. No, I don't. <sighs> anyway. No, I don't. Anyway, 
Uh, focus on your breathing. Focus on your breathing and look around. And it's, that's part of the reasons why we always want to do and and multitask is mm -hmm. because we're so conditioned to uh, with next, our phones. Next, 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 scroll, next. Scroll, scroll, yeah, scroll. It's like Jesus. No, but it's it's true. It's, it's true. a conditioning. It's all a conditioning. It's true. So we're gonna wrap it up. Wrap it up. Wrap it up. As always. We, we love, love you. you. We're, We're thinking, thinking about, about you. you. We'll see Have you guys tomorrow morning, Thursday. Have a great day. Keep it Minimize simple. Be a good person. Don't